Welcome back. You walk Templar. Recore. Now, remember correctly, we met old dude. I forget his name. But he let us borrow or have or whatever work with his spider bot, who's pecu peculiar to say the least. Peculiar. Pe peculiar. He's different. Alright, alright. Oh. Remember that audio thing I was supposed to fix? I still haven't done it. <laughs> alright. I haven't looked it up. I don't even know if there is a fix. I don't even know. I've been so busy. So busy. Planning things, making things happen. Gotcha. Don't interrupt us while we're doing this, man. I'm having to focus. Don't worry, Seth. We got this. Yeah, we totally got this. It's gonna work out just fine. God, I wish I could auto save. <laughs> Why is this the only way we can travel here? <laughs> That is a party, let me tell you. Okay, I'm here now. We can relax. Oh my god, we just started. We just started, and this parkouring, man. I mean, my hands a little sweaty, to be honest with you. Full, full disclosure, man, I can feel the nervousness. Oh. I don't mind. <laughs> why, why, why are you posing on this? I thought you got two out of this. White or wreck. And white or wreck. Looks like the legs and the torso. The four legs and the hind legs. What is this? The special rocks? The gooey rocks? What am I supposed to do with this? It looks different enough to where I have to point it out. It could be something later on. All right, enough party time. Gotcha. That's the way, Seth. You did it. I promise. Next time, by episode five, I will have looked up. Oh, Did what you... is that? New audio log. I will have looked up how to fix the audio. I've been preparing for your launch a long time. I just get too excited. I just start playing. When your ship finally left, I just start playing. Like yesterday, I mean, not even yesterday. Last episode was, was today as too, as well. I know I can't talk to you directly since you're already in cryosleep, and even if I could, the communication lag would just get worse the farther you got from Earth. So I thought, why not record some messages and send them to you for when you woke up? Ah. Consider them. Half official, half private. Well, guess your old dad can't mope around forever. What the? We've got lots of work to do. What did you just do? Did Research you see that? To make sure the Far Eden project succeeds. Now, I'm going to do all I can to support you and the other heroes on that ship. And that includes Mag, who I hope is sleeping close beside you. Until next time. Love you, kiddo. Was that for me? I just happened to have just enough. Treasures inside. One, nine cases, one core, one life increase. I swear, if, if you have a time trial and parkour in here, you're gonna be very upset. It's as if the prismatic cores are used for go. things. Core foundry. Crafting parts and using core fusion to upgrade friendly core bots is the key to success in Fa'in. 
so be sure to visit. Uh, uh, never mind. The higher the core quality of an enemy, the more fusion energy he will yield if extracted properly. Properly. Focus. Extracting cores from enemies will yield much more fusion energy than core shards. So murdering them, exploding them to little bits, not as useful. Well, his name's Kai. It's like Cobra Kai. Sounds good. Mac, Seth, let's go. Seems like the deeper we get into the coolness. Does he auto shoot missiles or whatever those are? Photon launchers? I thought they were missiles. Oh, yes, of Over course. Here, Seth. He's no Mac. But I'm not mad at him either. <laughs> so media audio is acting up even more so on this mission than before. I guess I could look it up now. That sounds like work. <laughs> I probably should look it up now, seeing as for some reason out of nowhere. Oh god! I might have to switch to Mac. Yeah, because I need that damage. We need to get. Here we go. Gotcha. Got his core. Alright, real quick. You know what? I'm gonna force myself, because otherwise I'm probably gonna procrastinate again and wander off. My brain's gonna go off like a butterfly looking at flowers. I'm gonna look it up right now. Give me a second. Okay. From what I read online... One of the settings I've changed was actually in my audio settings for my actual speakers for them to be set at 24 bit 9600 hertz or 96000 I should say 96000 hertz but the thing is this place looks wrecked it's still there another thing they said was to like verify the game files also you sh I should note to all of y'all that like my capture card can only do like Stereo up to 16 bit. I think it's like 4800, 48,000 hertz. So even if I do fix it for my headset to where I hear it, it might still be on the recording. So I figured, you know, we'll just power through it because a lot of people online were like, you know what, just turn on subtitles because it never got optimized well. Like some people say, like older rigs, it doesn't happen at all. But for a lot of people, they said, yeah, it just keeps on happening. So, weird. But alright. That's fine. What was I supposed to do? Oh, find the little chargey boys. They're missing again. They're on the other side. Do I need the spider boy? What's down there? Is that good? Is that good things that are down there? Because it looks like a grinder of some kind. Oh, all right. It's electrified. I need to unelectrify it. But how? Can you do something with this, my friend? All right, I'm gonna go down here. Right? Because the map says there's stuff down here. There you are. Come with me. Just gonna go over here. There you go. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give me the juice. 
Things have escalated quickly. Ooh. It didn't have to make sense because I was using my kind of science. Slam him. It's unfortunate. But the only way is all the way. Oh, oh, ha! Ah, wiggle waggle the juices. Melt him. Melt him. Meow his world. Shrek. Gotcha. The juice is mine. There you go. It's time. Time to duel, Mac. Time to duel. Give him the science. Okay. Don't be afraid. They're gone now. Come That's with right. me to your socket. Get in there. Science. Huh? The truth has been revealed. Robots are made from metal and other robots. My god. This is Mewtwo's evil no no bounds. There you go. Let's do this. We live up here now. This is where we belong. Kind of, not really. I'm very confused. Oh, I see. The trash shoots. Certain materials are essential to the core production process. While rare on Earth, the crystalline structures we needed were in front of the supply on Far Eden. Yeah, Far Eden was like, we got so many. Oh my God, Proby's Pro. In fact, we could use less of them. We have too many of them. Ooh, audio this log. Is Dr. Julius Roldan, chief scientist and Far Eden project leader. <laughs> Man, there's a lot of science happening over here. You guys should come over here and help us with it. It's too much science. All the other teams landed safely and are sleeping in their crawlers. Forecasts predict a break in the storms a few days from now, so I should be able to receive transmissions from mandate mission control. Of course, they'll be decades old due to the distance between Earth and Far Eden. <laughs> but I'll take any news I can get. In the meantime, I have plenty to do. First, see how many of the Corbot advance units are operation. Mankind has a whole new world, gotcha. and we can't do it on our own. We'll need robots. Robots with cores. Colorful cores, that is. Texas rainbows, as they call them on the streets. Look out! Those core bites are in attack mode! Take them out! Do something! Gotcha. Expose too much. I see. An old cat of wampus type of game, is it? Huh? Defend me, Orbo. So his name's uh, what's his name? Zoner? <laughs> Zap boy? <laughs> My other one's named Mac. This one's named something. Oh, I gotta tell him to do something. Yeah! <laughs> Julie should be helping me out here. I can't remember his name. He's making me feel bad. Uh, Eric? Sam? Jules? No, I'm Jewel. Oh man, this is getting awkward. Hopefully he doesn't notice I don't remember his name. Mm. Find a way up. Can we pull the cores out of those? Because they're kind of, you know... Big and thick. Can we do this? Are we good here? Nice. What's this? Use console. Let's see what this console does. <laughs> well, it moves this thing over here, which is good. Yes. So now we can zip zap zoop over here, right? Right. What's with this nubbin? Is this nubbin important? It's supposed to be doing that? All right. One of those casual nubbins. Huh? Is that? Is that what we're supposed to do?
All right. Come back over here. There it is. And now what? Let's go. Seth, come on. We go over here like this. Huh. Can Is that I feel like I'm missing something. Am I supposed to grab onto it while it's traversing? Because that's kind of difficult. Like, how do I know the timing? Oh. Alright, there you go. That's how you do it. You force it. Hey, you just Kai, do it. I see fire. <laughs> must be the forge. Isn't fire hot? Huh? should be fine. The frames have really high melting points. But you... Got it. Don't touch the fire. Yeah, you don't have high melting points. Fire hot, Jewel. You should consider not touching it. What am I supposed to do in here? Huh. Am I supposed to fall down? I can make it- oh, I can make it over there and climb up seas. Oh, okay. This one's more about patience. You gotta let the fire do its thing. So the fire's gonna light up there. Ooh, hot, spicy floor. Bad spicy. Not tasty treats like you're used to. And then, like, it cools off. And then this one lights up. This one gets spicy. What? You gotta be kidding me. Oh, good. I see what I gotta do. Um, let's go ahead and change, dudes. Do it. Get out of here, Mac. Get out of here. Gotcha. More enemies. It wasn't enough. Extract back. Hit him. Uh, of course, there's another one. Why not? Hit him. Hit him. Gotcha. Don't turn, don't show me that it's, the shield is turning off when I'm still on the burning floor. Like, I don't know if it's turned off or not. <laughs> like, come on now. I don't trust you. I don't trust the cutscene to do me justice, okay? I have a feeling I can get shot. No offense, Zach? Is that what your name is? Zips? Eric? Smithens? I don't know how I forgot this so much. There you go. Was there something over there on their ledges? There is. They got the weird juice. What are these cryptic points are that I don't even get to use on anything? What are these points for? I don't know, I'll grab them though. They gotta be important to someone. God knows I like points of all kinds. I think we found the analyzer. Big ring <laughs> in a big room? That's it. Just put the prismatic core into the main console, and we'll be all set. Do the thing. 
Alright, was it supposed to do this? Well, I'm doing it. Oh god, it's bright over here. Does the sun know that it just is no longer necessary? Because we got the Uber Sun over here. Where? Okay. I could probably make that, right? Hopefully, I don't have to fight anything in here. To me. No, not use counsel. Not, not talk to a little Zachary Zip Zap Spider Boy. Focus. Huh. Looks like the power cores are missing. There ought to be an incubation chamber nearby. You should find plenty of cores in there. You think it's that door that just opened? Come on, Zachary. Let's go check it out. Before any of these other flying robot machines gets to it. Is that door is that the sound of a door opening? At least the colors don't matter too much to the small ones. Because they're really tiny. At the same time, did there need to be so many of them? Alright. This appears to be a crazy place full of robot parts and nonsense. What? Ah, uh, switch. Change places. Hit him. Hit him, Mac. Hit him. Extract. Right. It's time. Whoosh. Okay. Ever combat fast when it comes to any combat in this game, because I feel like the more time I give them, the more ch chances they got to goof me. Yellow. Yellow keys is what it's called for here. But Mac, we don't have yellow. This one wants white. Let's open up this chest. Well, well, well. What do we have here? <laughs> Rifle yellow affinity upgrade. Hey, we got yellow. We found upgrade. Nice. We found red. We were given blue, and we found yellow. Now I can deal damage to these freak jobs more effectively. Charge! Blast them! Extract! Inventory full! Inventory full! It's been only a few seconds! Alright, pull it. Pump them. Pump them! Inventory full, extracted yellow 11s. They're just sitting around there now. I don't like it. I'm getting too many cores now. All right, let's take a look at these. Can I organize them? Let's see. Level 14, level 12, level 7, level 8. 8, 8, 8, 8, 8. A bunch of green 8s. A 13, a 14, a 13, a 4, 12, 12, 13, 14, 11, 12. 15. These, who numbered these? It appears the lowest thing I got is this 7. Which I guess we'll trash. And I'll get rid of one of the many eights that I had. Remember when I was gaining those green cores because I didn't know any better? Does green mean I gain both yellow and blue points from it? Vice versa, the orange means I get both red and yellow points from it. I guess we'll find out. Kind of. Well, let's pick up these yellows, because these are level 14 yellows, right? Oh, level 13, level 12. That's pretty good. Is there fast travel inside this dungeon? <laughs> That'd be super useful. Ah, oh, I can start the dungeon over. Can I just leave while in progress? That'd be nice to know. Also, there's a treasure chest way back there that I left. Oh, it's a supply cache. I'm gonna let's go ahead and try why not why not what do we have to lose doing this entire dungeon all over again hold on which dungeon is it let's try to remember where are we the house of steel no that's not where we're at 
The cradle? No. Are we in here? I don't even know. Where are we? Oh, we're in the core foundry. Okay. Back to base. I really need to. I didn't know I was going to get full of cores again. Can I get an inventory upgrade? Can I double my core storage capacities? I'm a man who needs many cores. Look at my face. <laughs> Notice how it's aged and weathered because of lack of cores. Sure seems like it. Transfer successful. Alright, let's take a look. Blueprints. Spider Boy, what do we have for you? We've unlocked yellow tusk and yellow iron tusk uh, weapons away. We're definitely going to need that. We need you to get more damage out. Alright. Level 10. Are you... Got it. Does he have his own levels? I'll just, I'll just buy both of his right now. Body upgrade. Bingo. What level is he? Are we all the same level? Let's go to core bots. He is level 9. He can't even use the upgrades I just bought for him. Fantastic. Still, though... We'll upgrade his attack when we can. Let's go back to blueprints over here for Mac. We can turn him into a bigger, deadlier machine. I really wish he can get, get a compare screen right here. So I forget what he... Ha it, does, it just tells me what I've researched. It doesn't tell me what he has equipped. I'm pretty sure he has blue and yellow in the front, right? And then he has the red nubbins. Hmm. Which, one the, which one's the big bad beetle boy? I think red, right? We can't use it till he's level 15, though. But we might as well start building things, right? Give him the chomp chomp face. These are the expensive ones, right? Might as well get these built and researched. Once they're done researched, we don't have to worry about them being researched and unresearched anymore. Same thing with the red rear legs, yeah. The red parts, so we can That's finish it. getting those. Those are like his final form when he reaches level 15. And unfortunately, I mean, I guess we might as well just start knocking things out for the research purposes. Ah, we'll go with the low-level white ones. We'll unlock those Perfect. until we're out of points. Aha. And then we have to find more broken robot parts. Nice. Can't do that. I can do the nubbin. It worked. And the head. And then I'm out of supplies. Yes. And there's nothing left to research right now. Can't equip nothing to him. Oh, I take that back. Hold on. The zombie head he can have. Nice. And get a bonus to him right now. You wouldn't have to have zombie legs, would you? No. You've got to be level 10 to get the, the next upgrades. Save Loda. Give him the zombie head. It's Seth. Seth. Oh, I should have known. How could I have known the parasite would follow? All right, let's see. What do we like? He's wearing the yellow bare bones. Looks like the blue slightly better. Oh, except for defense. Even though it looks chunkier. Right? Definitely looks chunkier. Gets more energy and more attack, though. Slightly less defense. Hold on, let's go back. I didn't mean to do that. What about your nubbin? <laughs> what about your nubbin? I call it the nubbin, the augment. And this one's good, good enough for now. He's mostly blue now. Just for attack purposes. Otherwise, I think yellow is more balanced. Um, now we gotta go over here for fusions. Seth, we need you to get upgraded brigaded right now. I'm gonna give you some attack. So your attack's kinda lame, but also slow. So it might as well be powerful. Get in there, get in there! Stack him up! He's out. He's at 120, he's almost maxed. You know what, I got a lot of energy to spare. Let's go ahead and raise his energy up a little bit. Right about there, I 
thing for now. Mac? Don't have any, I mean, you're almost maxed that. 126, almost maxed that. You are maxed energy. No, you're not maxed energy. Let's do that. More juice. I want you to be able to slam jam whenever you want to, whenever the feeling arises. I want you to look toward the moon and say, I wish I could slam jam the moon. And then one day we do it. We do it together, Mac. We go up there with Louis Armstrong, we slam jam that moon. Okay. Good enough for me, except changes. All right, let's get out of here. They're powered up. They got a little bit more meat on their bones. Hold on, jump. What's up, Violet? Tell me the truth. Can I do it? Can I win the recore? Poor Foundry. Yes, take me there. Yeah, you too. Wait, were the recordings I was listening to that I didn't understand them, were they Violet's recordings? I just realized the voice is a little bit similar. All right, day one, we arrived. There's a bunch of tiny little tick robots laying around being goofs. I was very unimpressed. What? I was slightly impressed by that one that startled me. I have to fight him again. Come on, slam it down. Don't even give him a chance. Get rid of him. Get rid of him. That is a lot of damage. All right. That is a lot of damage. Get him. Get him. Go get him. That was way too much damage. That laser killed me. Oh, I see. I just wanted to kill him. I want to get through this, okay? What's that? Sturdy knuckles. Oh man. I get too many cords as it is right now because I'm too good at it. I noticed that I'm kind of a glass cannon. They like, they just touch me and I take so much damage. What's up there? What's all this? I didn't notice this before. Is this the treasure chest I was told about in the map that I forgot about? It is. Open sesame. What was it? What did I forget? The blue hatchling HDR spider legs. I can give Seth. I'm gonna try to remember that. It's kind of difficult. <laughs> Seth, his robot legs. This battery Omic powered. I don't have to do this fight again, do I? Was that door open for a second? Huh. Let's leave. Let's pretend we didn't see anything, shall we? Seth? How's the zombie head treating you? Good? Master of the domain. We don't have to do this fight again, do we? This isn't even the fire zone. If I have to do the fire zone again, I'm gonna be very upset. Very upset he's spaghetti. Fed up fettuccine, that's what I'll be. Or is it frustrated fettuccine? Just livid linguine. That's one, right? You guys let me know down in the comments below if I'm getting these correct. At least I'm getting good at that, am I right? Oh my god. MLG. These cubes respawn. If you really wanted to grind this place- Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, 
least I don't have to do the fire part again. Wait, it's not over. It's not over till it's over. Well, focus on this guy first. He seems upset about something. Extract. Slam jam. Brazil. Oh, wait, I, I unlocked yellow. I forgot. Whoosh! Instant pull. You were too busy being distracted. You fool. Well, at least I fought the fight better this time. That counts for something. I had to do it twice, but this time I owned it. I made it my own. People look up to me now and say, that guy, he knows how to recall. <laughs> okay, I grabbed the one that was down there and I double ledge grabbed somehow and that worked out fine. Come here, Mac. We're going back in. We're getting tactical. Oh, wait. Yes, because we already unlocked that door. Yeah, we don't have to change nothing. Slide in. There you go. Now, as far as, far as these freaks go, they can they die easy. See that? They, they ain't a thing. They ain't nothing. Oh, no. Mac, wiggle waggle. I don't like that sound he makes when he gets hit with electricity. That made me feel bad. What's going on up here, huh? Is this where the secrets go to die? Aha! Doesn't appear to be anything up here. No, I, 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 I get it. I take a hint. I can take a hint. I don't want to get stuck. Ah, oh, of course. Why not? Let's fight him again. Hit him again. Get him. Ooh, ooh, give him the stool. Don't pick you. And now I already have the yellow juice points. Where are you going? Where'd you go? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. These guys are cheating. These guys are cheating. Got him. Got him. Clapped. Game over. Come over here, over. Because the game is over. All right. Looks like some of the juice respawned in here. Better pick it up. Use it for good. Unlike these little robots, they're using it clearly for some sort of selfish evil reason. Hence why everything's broken and they're hanging out in the junk. Because they're little goofballs. Goofballs of evil. Okay. That's all safe, then. That, that's fine. That's that loose chunk that's not worth anything. Just normal debris on the Edens. Okay, this looks like it's important. Hello? Oh, good. Cool. Full of big gorilla dudes. Oh, they're yellow. Switch to yellow, Mac. I gotta get out of here. Let's get out of here, Mac. Oh, traction. Slide down. Gotcha. Oh, you changed colors, huh? Let me get Gotcha. Okay. Huh? Someone's using range on us. The old shooting scoot, I see. 
He was no match for me and my impressive chins. Mm-hmm. Right, of course. Yes. Aha! And then I do uh, this. Give me that juice. Give me this. Give me this. I want. Looks important to me. Yeah. Yeah. Found a power core. Just need one more. All right. This is the incubation station. What are you doing? That's safe. I guess he just had robot gyros, right? He has that epic robot robotic balance thing going on for him. Ow. Alright. Whose idea was that? You think they'd make a facility that was easy to get around, man? Grab it. Slice it and dice it. All right, you just gotta time it right. See, it closes. It opens. There you go. Now what? I guess I'm going over here now. <laughs> Hold on. It's not gonna stay open forever. Yeah, it's gotta reactivate and go back up there. No, no, no! Satan! <laughs> Uh, of course. Uh, of course. Why wouldn't we have to start all over? That's good math right there. Give me a lift. Well, we play the waiting game. We gotta be perfect now. <laughs> Hold on, he's gonna activate. He can't shoot it yet. Got it. Go over here. I don't know how I'm gonna do this right. Because that is just moving, dude. That is doing what it wants. That, yeah, yeah, that's good. That's nice. Real lovely. Real lovely. <laughs> I don't like this gatekeeping puzzle here. No. It gives me a little bit more time on that jump pad than I thought it would. So maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, what? Oh, come on. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that was stupid. That was stupid. You see how I didn't ledge grab at all? I just bounced off of it. Why? I'm over here now, again. <laughs> All problems are given solved if I just had a double dash. Who designed this, huh? Alright, there it is. There it is. Getting good at a weird thing, man. Getting really good at a very weird thing. Ah, oh, yes. Let's head back to the analyzer. Now the door unlocks once you pull two <laughs> incubator cores out because it knows. Listen, there's an AI following me around helping me. Welcome. It's not making these things easier. What is up with this, man? Any more? Anything else? Really? 
Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Surprise didn't kill me. Ah, good, good, good. I'm glad. I'm glad I can start off injured for this fight. Send it more. There you go. Collect 100 floors. Be upset about it, too. What is this? Careful, guys. Rollers. Rollers. What is, what is the job of these, huh? Just be in the way and cause problems. That's good. Make it past the chompers and the rollers so you can do your job. They weren't too bad, but still, I'm like, why, bro? Yeah, you're right, Mac. You're right. Why she got to do that to me? Get in there. All right, we got your precious cores. They're just the right colors, too. Oh, no. Bingo. The analyzer's up and running. All right, let's check out that prismatic core. It's gonna say, man, this core is prismatic. It's colorful. You know how colorful the other cores are? Well, this one's more colorful. This one's all the colors. Let's see what makes you tick. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. All the colors of the rainbow are in there. Be careful. I like how my boys are freaking out next to me. Right. Dad. I knew it would be you. Dad. Kai. Did you hear that? There were voices coming through the core. Maybe it's some kind of transmission from the ships in orbit. Uh, all I see on my end is a wall of mandate encryption. I don't have enough copy power in my crawler to crack it. What could it mean? I know a place that does. <laughs> we have to go there next. Oh, God, it's turned evil now for some reason. The core, it overloaded the analyzer. It's gonna blow. Mm. Mm. All right. What am I supposed to do with those? the whole foundry okay i see some energy cells they look like they're overheating destroy them quick destroy the energy cells that are overheating is that really the solution to this problem looks like we're going back up okay well that's not happening You ever notice how the solution to problems is more problems? <laughs> this is just me. Ah. Alright, that's two of those. <laughs> Ow! Ooh, radiation burning me. Ah! Ooh, fun! Yay! <laughs> Slippy happy! Yeah, yeah. Hi, I did it. But the analyzer's still going crazy. There have to be more cells on the other side of the room. You need to go back. Back it's the okay, way you came. We can do this. Seth, come on. Well, that's us falling to our death right there. Come to me. I am losing health really fast. Okay. Well. Well, that was a lovely fun time. Where are the other ones? Wasn't there one there? Is it making me just redo the ones I messed up? Because that's very forgiving. Ooh. Uh, thought I 
Okay, <laughs> you know, that was very nice of them. They're like, you know what, this part's kind of... kind of so, harrowing, to where say do the you least. Think we can crack the mandate encryption on the prismatic core? We're just gonna show Joel being cooked alive by radiation and... <laughs> hopefully everyone will enjoy so that, yeah. <laughs> There's a tram at the back of the foundry that leads straight to the E-Tower. I'll meet you there. All right, sounds good. Seth, let's go. Good. Wait, where's this go? This is where the rollers were, wasn't it? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and mosey on over here. Easily, but I thought I had to use this one. To get over back over there, I was very wrong. It confused me because it showed me o it opening up, and I thought to myself, "Oh, okay, I, I just go over there from here." But that wasn't the case. Anywho, I think we're gonna do a little cut right here. Thank you all. This has been Ewok Temple. We're going through Recore. Hopefully, you all enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Keep on posting, and I'll see you all in the next one. Y'all take it easy. Thing. Oh, I gotta tell him to do something. Show him what you got. Yeah! <laughs> Julie should be helping me out here. I can't remember his name. He's making me feel bad. Uh, Eric? Sam. Jules. No, I'm Jewel. Oh man, this is getting awkward. Hopefully he doesn't notice I don't remember his name. <laughs>